Welcome in all my friends. Lazy Retired Granny here. Today is Thursday, March 21st, 2024. The time is 6.12 a.m. here in still dark and supposed to be rainy, Salem, Oregon. And I forgot to turn off my scanner. going in the background. I am continuing my journey on Diamond Art Club's Anticipation of the Day Ahead by Chuck Penson. And this is a 36.6 inches by 27.6 inches or 93 by 70 centimeters. It has 59 colors which includes four ABs. AB stands for Aurora Borealis, which are drills with a special effect coated on them, and they are great for creating extra shimmering effects on the diamond painting. And I am still, yes, still down here working. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. I have not been diamond painting a lot. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm falling behind here. <laughs> but that's okay. Life gets busy sometimes. So beside me is my caffeinated copy in my You'll Shoot Your Eye Out coffee mug with French Vanilla Creamer. And of course, I forgot to turn on my candle light wax thing so let me get that just one minute um it's the um cotton candy melon and musk candle wax that i got from hobby lobby on the 40 percent off sale so, let me get that a-going, and let's see, what else, I think that is about it. Okay, so we're raring to go here, yeah, I have a lot of projects that I want to get done today. I'm feeling ambitious. Do you ever have those days where you you just feel ambitious? That's me today. So um so I'm gonna see how much I get done on my project list today. Okay, so I am working on color 33. Color 33 are the case, which is 815. Let me look that up. 815, where are you? Medium Garnet. Alrighty then, let me turn on my light here. Gotta have my light on. I'm addicted to my light. So yeah, they said it's supposed to start raining. It was supposed to start raining yesterday at five o'clock. Now I went out at five o'clock and it was not raining. And this morning I went out, still no rain. So I don't know what it's doing out there. <clears throat> but um, the says the weather said it's supposed to be raining for the next few days so I thought you know what I gotta get out there and get that lawn mowed my lawn was so long it took a whole bag of grass and I just mowed it Saturday 
that's how fast it grows. And uh, David's wasn't too bad. It's just mine that seems to want to grow like crazy. Which is weird because, you know, Ellie's out there and, I don't know, maybe she fertilizes it all the time. Maybe that's why. You might hear my washing machine in the background. Yep, I'm finally doing laundry. I think it's on the spin cycle. Um, but anyway, <clears throat> so I thought, you know, I'm going to get out there because I am not, I repeat, not going through what I did last time when it was so long. Oh my gosh, what a nightmare that was. So, but it was perfect weather to mow the yard and... I just had my jeans and um, sweatshirt on. I didn't even break a sweat. Mm -hmm. So it was a pleasure out there mowing the yard. I had it done in no time, didn't have any issues with the lawnmowers that broke in again. So they're all working good. And uh, Ellie was outside having a good time while I was mowing and yeah, so so that was all good. Did some pooper scooping before I mowed and uh, I was the sun was not out it it was very cloudy but you know still you know I don't, you know it wasn't hot it wasn't cold it was just right and I wanted to get <clears throat> some video of that um, wind chime that I did, but you know what? It was so cloudy, the sun wasn't out at all, and I wanted to get the sparkles in the sunshine, and it wasn't happening yesterday. So I don't know when I'm going to get that video done because i got to wait for the sun to come out. But it is pretty. We had a little bit of a breeze and uh, it was twirling around out there and that was pretty. I have it hanging over on my side, on um, my uh, my son's porch because I don't have any place to hang it over here. Um, yeah, when I would, got done mowing, I was sitting out there watching Ellie and the, the uh, hummingbirds came over. They were chirping, and they're happy, and they were eating. Yeah, today I'm going to clean out their feeder and give them fresh food. I got a shower this morning. Ah, coffee. So, uh, so that was good.
and I'm I have not done laundry in oh my gosh week and a half so I'm finally getting laundry done today and even though I do not have to file taxes I do file them just you know, on record. So I still haven't done that. So I'm going to do that. I don't know if there is controversy about that on whether to file taxes or not. I don't know. Um, I don't understand enough about taxes, but I do mine on TurboTax, and so it just practically does everything for you. So I am going to get that done this morning. And I have some other little things I want to get done on my computer because I have the computer all to myself today. I think um, my son has to go to Portland for work today and I have got to check because next week is spring break for the schools here but I will tell you I was going to look this up and I forgot, so let me do this quick. Um, let's see. Sometimes Oh, why did I do that? Um, when they're going on break, sometimes they get off. Um, the days before. So I want to look. Okay, March. What's today? The 21st? Ah, yeah. No school today or tomorrow. And then spring break starts Monday. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Uh, so, but there, my two grandkids are on, it shouldn't affect me at all, because I'm not on their, I don't know how that works, because I'm not on their internet, but our satellite all goes to, you know, one place. I don't know. I just don't know. I should have checked on that, but you know what? I didn't, so. All right, the next one is capital T, which is 38. And that is 934, which is black avocado green. All right. So do we have a lot of teas? We got them over here. We got them there. We got some here. So anyway, I do have some computer stuff I want to do, which is going to require downloading and all that stuff so yeah I found a new trick <laughs> yeah I want to have fun with it so anyway that's on my project list today and what else is on my project list um, Hmm. 
That's going to take me a while. It shouldn't take me very long on the taxes. That's pretty simple to do. Because I have all my information and nothing ever changes except for my age. And I was at the doctor's office the other day and checking in and she says, do you still live here? And I said, yep. And she said, da, 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 da. And she said, do you have any changes at all? And I says, only my age. And she laughed. <laughs> which I'm about ready to, well, not about, still got a few months before that birthday runs or comes around again. I remember when I was younger and I was working in The older crowd, you know, the ones in their 40s, you know, just being 40s and listening to them talk and, um, you know, how it was when they were younger and all that. And it's like, I can hardly wait that, you know, I can add to that because I'm still so young and yeah, now that I'm an oldster, it's like, I want to be a youngster. <laughs> so I must have did this area right because I can hear it clicking in there. <laughs> Oh, I am so bad at squares. Square and paired. Oh, so let me tell you the story about my son's car again. I know you're all into the edge of your seats just wanting to know what's going on well you know my son's car um he was having issues with it and so um anyway it had he thought it was the engine but to get that repaired is expensive. So he was, you know, thinking about getting a new car anyway. So he went down Sunday, got his new car. You know that. Well, his car is a 2013, his old car. And I said, well, just take it to the shop and have him run a test on it you know and at least that way you know what's wrong with it so when you sell it you know what price to sell it for and um you know what's wrong with it that's what you you know and if it's expensive to repair you know you're going to be upfront about it so anyway he called the dealership where he purchased the car originally and they said it sounds like the problem they're having with that car that was a recall and they said
they would go ahead and put it on their machines and whatnot and, you know, do a diagnostic check on it. Now, if it was part of the recall problem, then they would fix that, you know, for free underneath the recall. Well, um, but they wouldn't know until, you know, they put it on their machines. So he said, well, I really don't want to drive it down there. It's, you know, this is what it's doing and I don't want to, you know, make it worse. And they said, well, go ahead and have it towed. And he, they said, you'll have to pay for the towing, but if it is a recall issue, then they would reimburse him for the towing. So he called the tow people and I think we'll do the eyes next. Well, I call them the eyes. I don't know what they are, but let's see. They go where are they I know you're screaming at me I see them I see them and I don't I'm having a hard time finding it hmm oh wait no 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 I remember now those are the hourglass but they're so much smaller um, on the canvas than they are on here these are super sized and those are 57 and that is three eight five six ultra very light mahogany. I guess that's what that is. All right. So um, yeah, he called the tow people, and they were out yesterday morning about I don't know eight eight thirty and picked up the car. And the tow guy had to get in the car to put it on the tow truck. And he told my son, wow, your car looks practically brand new inside. They were really impressed with how well it looked inside. But anyway, so they um, towed it off. And... Then later the shop called my son and said it's a recall issue. So they said, however, his was pretty bad. So they are going to have the car about three weeks because... They're putting in a brand new engine. So, yeah, so now they're going to reimburse him for the tow, which was expensive. And so that's a good thing. Plus, they're putting in a brand new engine. So when he sells it, the value of the car just went up. It's going to have zero miles on the engine. <laughs> so he's assuming when they do all that, you know, they're going to have to do other things. So, so anyway, yeah, so um, that was good news for him. And I said, well, and they were, they said they would give him a rental car, but he doesn't need a rental car because he bought a brand new car. <laughs> so anyway, I said, well, are you upset now that you bought a new car? And he said, no, no, no. He said, I, you know, he, he really likes his new car. 
but there's things about his old car that he's going to miss. You know, and like he said, well, could... if he would have had it in the shop before, you know, I don't know. He probably would have been rethinking what he wanted to do, but on the other hand, he knew he was going to get a new car anyway, so. But whatever he gets out of his car, he's going to put that money towards his new car. So, that'll be good. So that was exciting news yesterday. Hey girly, are you ready for your breakfast? Did you wake up? I don't think Ellie's been feeling too good. Um, I think yesterday she may have eaten something she shouldn't have outside. I don't know what it is, but she loves to eat dirt quads and she likes to eat grass clippings yeah she has been like that since she was a pup so i really have to watch her but you know how that is <sighs> machine sounds like it's ready to take off. Airplane. But yeah, she ate yesterday and then threw up. And then she felt better. So... I'm just keeping an eye on her. Um, but she did eat last night and didn't throw up, so. So hopefully it was just a bit of a tummy issue. There's nothing in my yard that, that I know of, you know, that's poisonous or anything, so I don't think the grass is poisonous. And no spraying or, you know, we don't do weed killers or any of that. Um, okay, copy time. Let's see, what other exciting things have been happening? I really, really, really need to get to the store and fill up my water jugs. I don't know if I'll do that today or not. We'll see how I things go. Usually if I'm going to go to the store, I do it early in the morning when nobody's out and about. But 
I don't need to do it today, so. So yeah, oh my goodness, we're at 909 subscribers. Or, as I like to say, friends. I'm pretty stoked about that, really, because I never thought I would have 909 friends. And some of you have commented that I need to do an hour-long whip and chat. <laughs> Believe me, I could do one. I've always got something to talk about. I could sit here and babble all day, probably, but... This is uploading, I think, what I'm going to do is go ahead and get my taxes done, and I'm, I'm scheduling that, that'll only take me maybe a half an hour to do, so that'll be pretty quick, and What else? Um, and then I'm going over to my Facebook account and what I'm doing is transferring some more of my videos from Days Gone By of Ellie. That does take me a while. So, but I only want to spend a couple hours doing that today. Because that is quite the process. But anyway, I can get those scheduled and. Those raring to go. And I think I'm going to attempt to do those as shorts. Rather than, you know, those puppy videos that I've been doing, you know, they're three or four minutes long. Yeah. Um, but I think most of the Ellie videos I have are not as long. It shouldn't be too much. Ooh, my washing machine's shut off. Yay for me. So yeah, that'll be a huge project. And when I'd rather be diamond painting than that. <laughs> it's like... 
but you know sometimes I do need a break from diamond painting so maybe I can diamond paint for a little bit and then do some videos for a little bit and then diamond paint for a little bit But I do have another canvas I'm working on. So right now I'm just a double whipper. <clears throat> Not a triple whipper. Yeah, I got to, um, <clears throat> and then I've got some videos I need to do. I'm going to have a, I have a Timu haul that's coming and my Amazon order and my Dreamer Designs. I've got two of those to do. Product review. Uh, let's see what else I got. Yeah. So lots of stuff are coming. Just got to do it. still looking for another table oops I missed these down here how did I miss the oh and over here what in the world um yeah I'm still looking for a table for um, my unboxings and stuff I know what I want. It's just a matter of trying to find it. I missed the, all of these over here. My goodness gracious. Yeah, when I do videos now, I have to kind of maneuver things around and whatnot, which is okay. And this is a nice desk, you know, it doesn't wobble or, you know, all that. So it's heavy and sturdy. I do like it. And it's long. It's just that, you know, when you do these bigger paintings they take up the whole practically the whole desk <laughs> but I do have it set up now a little bit better where <clears throat> I have more room so that's a good thing
Hey Google, what's the weather today? Today in Salem, it'll be cloudy with a forecasted high of 61 and a low of 46. Right now it's 50 degrees and cloudy. Hey Google, is it going to rain today? The next few hours look clear. Tonight in Salem, there's a moderate chance of rain from about 5 a.m. until the day after tomorrow at about 2 a.m. See, now they've changed the weather. Okay, so no rain until tonight. Okay, how long have I been on here? Let me look at my clock here. I've got a few minutes left. I can keep doing this coffee time. Yeah, with no sun, I um, haven't been able to see the sunrise. I miss that. I see the clouds rise. <laughs> so, V is having a live tonight, 7 o'clock her time, which would be, I think, 5 o'clock my time. So, oh, you know what? I need to write that down. Otherwise, I'm going to forget. I wonder if Google sets an alarm. Hey, Google, set an alarm for 4.55 p.m. today. Done. Your alarm set for 4.55 p.m. <laughs> I've never done that before. Yep, the year of changes. I am discovering all kinds of good stuff. That's good. You know, try something different and it's exciting. I really enjoy it when I learn something new. Yeah, so love to see you in her live. You know, I attempted a live and it was a train wreck. I was just, it was not a good thing. Um, but I do need to do another premiere. Maybe I'll put that on my list of things to do. Those are fun. I just think V is the cat's meow. I really enjoy watching her videos and all the things she does. <laughs> it's like, I'm so lazy compared to her. She's got so many things she does.
she's probably glad that we're getting into spring and summer so she can go out camping and hopefully give us some videos of where she's at. You know, and there really is nothing better than getting out there in the in the sunshine and relaxing, just being outside. I have never diamond painted outside, so. Maybe I'll give that a whirl. What do you think? I don't even know how I would set it up. She's got a sweet setup. She can diamond paint anywhere. See, and when I'm not at home, I grab my knitting bag and I knit if I know I'm going to have to be waiting. Okay, oh, missed another one up there. All right, let's look and see if I got all of these. Oh, there's some right there. Uh. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. So Mike's taken some time off from his channel. Hope he's doing some fun stuff and getting some relaxation in. can't even imagine working full time diamond painting having a youtube channel and you know doing all that wow oh there's some k's i missed wow come on granny pay attention There's some lines I missed, some nines I missed. Anything else I missed? All right, I'm gonna um, do that and then I'm gonna let you go. I think I can do that. There was something else I was gonna talk about. What was it? Um, hmm, what in the world was it? I'm not going to say the colors on this because I'm just, we may have already done these yesterday. I just got to fill in the ones that I missed, mainly because I don't think I've diamond painted since yesterday's. I'm going to do a little bit, but not a whole lot. Okay, there's the nines. And then the K's, which is 33. Oh, 
It's getting light outside. It is pretty outside with the light and the clouds. The clouds are beautiful out there today. Just a really pretty scene out there. I love my setup now because I can, um, you know, graze out the window, the, the sliding glass door, so I can see the sky and the forest across the, the way. I am just... Yeah, very blessed to live where I do and being able to appreciate everything out there. Okay, what else did I miss? What did I say? Okay, I got those. So I have, see there is a lot of little color blocking. Okay, it looks like the arrow going to the right I missed. So let's get that in. And then I'll let you go. I think that's the last one that I missed. Do you think I'll finish this section today? Okay, what are the odds? <laughs> there we go. I am hoping to in between all my little projects today. I can do it, right? 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 I can do it. Because I still have to move up here to that section. I've been on this section for days. <laughs> but that's okay. All righty. There we there it's done and dusted for this whip and chat so i do appreciate everybody stopping by and visiting with me and all my new friends um you know just a reminder to be sure and comment i want to hear what you're doing what you're working on what's going on in your world and um if you have anything that you want me to show off for you um send that in an email my email's down below, and uh, yeah, I I like reading your comments, getting emails, all that good stuff. And if you want to be my friend, hit that subscribe button. And if you want to know when my videos come up, uh, hit the notification bell, and it'll let you know that Granny is online. <laughs> Yep, give it a thumbs up. <laughs> All right, I am going to let you go. Have a wonderful day. Thanks for stopping by, and I will chat with you later.